Now let's see this question. A man purchased sugar worth rupees four hundred. He sold three fourth at a loss of ten percent, and the remainder at a gain of ten percent. That means one fourth at a gain of ten percent. On the whole, he gets profit or loss. What we have to find out. Okay. Now, some quantity is being sold at ten percent profit, and some quantity is being sold at ten percent loss. So, in case of loss, we put a minus sign over here. Okay. So, uh, overall, we don't know what is loss or profit. Let it be x. Okay. And ratio of these two is this is uh, three fourth quantity is selling at ten percent loss. That means this is three fourth quantity and this is one fourth quantity. It is three fourth and it is one fourth. Okay. Definitely, ten will be greater than x, so it is ten minus x, and it is x minus minus ten. That means it is x plus ten. So x is the overall profit or loss. So ten minus x upon x plus ten is equal to is it is in this ratio. That is three by four is to one by four, or we can say three by four divided by one by four. That is three. Now let's calculate x. So it is ten minus x is equal to three x plus thirty. That means four x is equal to minus twenty. That means x is equal to minus five. If x is negative, that means overall there is a loss, which is five percent. Okay. So very simple problem, or you can calculate it uh, quickly and easily. Friends, in profit loss problem. Do not forget to put this minus sign if there is a loss. And overall, you are getting a negative sign, so definitely there is a loss. If you are getting a positive sign over here, then definitely there is a profit. Okay, so just be careful about it.